And here we have the inside of the late 1960s, early 1970s Chateau Sport Vintage Chronograph watch. And as you can see, um, it is working. And this is an EB8420 movement, which is actually a very good movement. Um, it is very reliable um, and keeps great accurate time. Um, and I'll be quiet for a moment and you actually hear the ticking. It makes a great ticking sound. Let's see. I'm not a watch expert by any means, um, so I did not service the watch uh, myself. However, I did have the crystal replaced uh, by a professional at a watch shop, and so the crystal is brand new on it. But this is the inside. Uh, probably could use a good cleaning um, if you want, if you wanted to, on the inside. But it really doesn't uh, doesn't need it. Um, as far as it goes for, for functioning correctly. Um, it does need a wind every day. Uh, however, it winds very smoothly. And um, I have not had any issues with it as of yet. Um, let me see if I can activate the second hand. So you can see that in action. Let's see if we can get it to go. Shit. There we go. Now you can see the... that other gear moving. And on the back case on the inside, we have here, let's scan the, uh, the name of the trading company. And it is made in Switzerland, of course. And it appears to be uh, G-L-U-C-K trading company, Gluck, uh, or Gluck um, Trading Company, I'm sorry if I'm mis mispronouncing it. And so there it is for you. I uh, hope you enjoy it. And uh, that's my Chateau Vintage Watch.